Welcome to this tutorial on how to remove the HDPE and GFRP encapsulation layers. Fiber optic strain sensors from FBGS are suitable for harsh environments and can be embedded directly in materials like concrete. They normally come with full packaging and connections, but in some situations, you might need to work on the fiber yourself. For example, to add a connector or splice two fibers. Let's jump into it. To remove the GFRP and the optional HDPE layers, you will need an encapsulated fiber, a standard stripper for telecom fibers, alcohol and delicate task wipers, and optionally, a sharp cutter. In the first technique, we use the stripper following two steps. First, cut and remove the HDPE layer. Then, cut and remove the GFRP layer. This technique is good to use when the diameter of the encapsulation is not higher than 0.5 mm. Let us show you a bit slower. First, the outer HDPE layer. Place the fiber in the middle groove of the stripper. Press enough to cut through the first layer. Hold firmly and strip the encapsulation. Now, the GFRP layer. Place the fiber in the smallest groove of the stripper. Press enough to cut through the second layer. Hold firmly and strip the encapsulation. The second technique is better to use if you encounter an encapsulation that is too thick for the standard stripper. That would apply when the outer layer is thicker than 1 mm. In that case, you should remove the encapsulation with a sharp cutter, then proceed with the stripper as shown previously. As an alternative, you can always strip the GFRP layer with the cutter as well. In that case, be extra careful not to break or damage the fiber. Our fiber hack. Use thin gloves to get extra grip on the fiber but thin enough so you can still feel the fiber's texture. Sometimes you will find fibers only encapsulated in one layer. In that case, proceed with the first technique using the right groove. When the encapsulation layers have been removed and the fiber cleaned with alcohol, you obtain the following result. 